The first bullet trains that were unveiled in 1964 looked like a proper bullet. But very soon, engineers realized the bullet train would go through a lot of tunnels. Now, what's the problem there? Well, the problem is when you're going inside a tunnel at 300 km an hour, the air in the tunnel has no way to escape. It creates a sonic boom. The other side of the tunnel would ooze out a lot of waves coming out at a very dangerous speed. This sonic boom was extremely dangerous, and engineers had to do something about it. They realized that the best shape to cut through the air without creating this sonic problem is to make the face of the train similar to the beak of a kingfisher. It allows for optimum breaking of the air or water in a very streamlined way. That's exactly what the engineers wanted for the trains to do. They wanted the trains to pierce through the air, allowing it to escape not only in the front but also in the back. And so when you see the front of a bullet train, that's the beak of a kingfisher.